Hello YouTube, it's Keith Kevin Ken. How you doing? How you doing? I hope you're doing well. It's time again for a trimming. That means I'm selling off some Spydecos, some new ones like you see in my hand. Now here are the rules. This is USA only. I know I always get flack for saying that, but it's USA only. At the end of this video, there's a list of all of the knives and the prices. You need to email KeithKevinKen at gmail.com, same as this YouTube channel, but it's at gmail.com, and say, it's mine. I'll tell you if it's yours or not. Only send one email. It's only me with a computer. So don't get too over anxious. Last time, everyone kept sending multiple emails and it literally clogged down the system. So don't do that. Just send one email. I'll get it and I'll respond to you. Okay? I promise. It's mine. I'll say it's yours. And then you'll have 15 minutes to send your payment. This is PayPal only. PayPal only. Last time, another thing they clogged up is some, some folks kept trying to pay me with Gmail. No Gmail. PayPal only. If you don't have a PayPal, you'll miss this one. Don't worry. There'll be trimming coming up later. PayPal only. I'll give you my PayPal address. Please look at that PayPal address. Sometimes it changes. Don't just use the one that you have saved, please. And you will send it in goods and services only. I'll pay all of the fees sending goods and services. That way you're insured. It really helps me a lot in the process. Goods and services only. Do not send friends and family. Okay, I know you think that's helping me, but in this case, goods and services only. All right, try to keep one consistent email. All of this just helps me. But if you buy a knife this weekend, I'm shipping out on Monday. I really appreciate all of you guys. The rules are at the end of this video. Good luck. All right. Give me a chance to get situated. Last time I did a trimming, I had a bunch of para threes and paramilitary twos. This time around, I only have three paramilitary twos. This is the newest one. It's just a real nice with a black blade s35 vn steel s35 vn steel black coated blade all of these knives but by the way have never been used so it has factory blades i mean factory edges 165 dollars is what i'm asking for that 165 dollars all of these are under the usual prices, even though they haven't been used. If you go on the internet, you can see. This one is a paramilitary two with 52100 steel, 52100 steel. Uh, I'm charging $155. And the reason is, as some of you know, 52100 steel does mark up. This blade will come clean. But there are some marks on the blade. But trust me, this is a beautiful knife. Wonderful steel. That's for $155. A big discount because there are some markings on the blade that aren't that bad. This is my Digicam Paramilitary 2 S30V Steel, $120. Remember, it is U.S. only. You need to email to KeithKevinKen at gmail.com. It's mine. I'll tell you if it's yours. Just send one message. I will I'll ask you for another email if it's yours. But try not to clog up the process. Yes, it's brand new. Yes, it's sold out in a matter of minutes on Blade HQ. It's the Blade HQ exclusive Shaman. Yeah, it's the supersized native from Spydeco. This has CPM M4 steel. It has natural G10, which you can see through. You can see the skeletonized 
liners. Of course it has the compression lock. So does, I, I didn't think I had to tell you that the paramilitary twos have a compression lock, but they do. This is smooth. It was this smooth right out of the box, brand new. It's the Sham and the Blade HQ exclusive sold out in minutes. And I'm asking for $195, less than what Blade HQ asked for. Here's the Shaman, black blade, fully serrated edge with that wonderful compression lock. This is a nice knife, hard working knife. S30V steel, fully serrated, $175. Yes, this is the drunken. Yes, I know a lot of you asked for it and still haven't received it yet. Yes, it's brand new from Spydeco. Yes, it's the Dmitry Sinkovich collaboration with them. 3.5 inches S90V steel. Yes, it's 400 and something dollars, but not from me. It's $390. Brand new. Drunken pattern on the carbon fiber and on the titanium, custom pivot and pocket clip. I want you guys to have, this was a tough one, <laughs> but it is the drunken S90V steel, $390. The subvert, this is the beast of a knife from Spydeco. 4.1 inch blade with that recurve close. I call it instead of the belly, it's the neck of it all, right? Just a beautiful knife. Tie liners. S30V steel, $290. $290. Um, liner lock, beautiful titanium liners. Yes, it's the smock. Yes, I know some of you still can't get your hands on it. And yes, it is brand new to me. 3.4 inch blade, 2.9 inch for the edge, uh, 3.6 ounces, 7.9 inch total, Warncliffe blade, S30V steel, Kevin Smock design, $155. And of course, the push button compression lock. Boy, I'm sweating. It is hot in my apartment. <laughs> so, so if you see some drips of sweat, you'll understand. But just a beautiful knife. Here's another new one. Really new to me. Uh, they didn't send it to the, uh, the Collectors Club members. But I wanted it. It's the Autonomy 2. It's the Automatic from Spydeco. This is really nice. It has the Spydeco leaf shaped blade. It has the rust proof LC 200 in steel. They use it for ball bearings on spaceships. It is really a wonderful steel, $175, 3.5 inch blade. And you gotta hold on to it when you pop it out. Oversized button, you can lock it as well. Just a wonderful knife that you can use anywhere and you know it's not gonna get rusted. That's the Autonomy 2 for $175. Another new knife, the Kapara. I call it Kapara. K-A-P-A-R-A -A with the compression lock. Full carbon fiber scales. Oh, this is a beautiful knife. It has a little back spacer that's burgundy. It has the wire clip, deep carry clip, right, left hand, tip up only. Look at the pivot, is a wonderful pivot. Uh, it's S30V steel for $180. It has a compression lock. It's a beautiful knife, one of the new ones from Spydeco. Here's a pretty new one from Spydeco as well as the tropin. You know, last time I offered this in a trimming, it was super brand new. And then later, a week or two later, someone asked for it. And I said, no, we only do it 
for the trimming for the people on the channel first come first serve remember this is us only sale you have to email keith kevin ken at gmail.com just like this channel keith kevin ken at gmail.com you have to say it's mine i'll say it's yours please just send one request i'll get back to you and say it's only me here all night long all weekend long uh you have 15 minutes to make your payment if you don't we move on to the next person in line for that knife paypal only goods and services only i'll email you my paypal my paypal sorry paypal number this is the tropin three ways to open the tropin it has the emerson opener you can open it with the good old-fashioned spidical hole and of course you can, that's me, because my hands are so wet. Sorry about that, guys. You can flip it open. Trust me, it's a wonderful flipper. It has the compression lock. It has wonderful gray G10. Here's the thing that you heard about. You see that edge comes off of the blade. That was from Spydeco on purpose. They know it's there. Shouldn't affect you, but it is there. I want you to know that. And this wonderful knife, the Tropin $170 S30V steel. The Chinook 4. I was so happy when the Chinook came. It's thinner, it's lighter than the original Chinook. Look at that trailing point blade. So wonderful. S30V steel, 3.8 inches, 8.9 inches total. 5.6 ounces, $210 is what I'm asking for. S30V with the power backlock. Not just a regular backlock, but you see the two moving parts right there? That's the Spydeco power backlock. Man, this is a beast of a knife in a really nice package. The little Temperance 3. Oh man, this is a beast in the hand. A lot of knife in a small package. That thick spidical leaf shaped blade. S30V uh, steel. Ah, 2.9 inches. It's under that 3 inches. It's 4 ounces. And man, it has the compression lock. I have two of the originals, but this new one is a great knife. Ah. Less than a year old. This is, of course, has not been, actually hasn't been carried. Uh, the Temperance 3, the little Temperance 3 from Spydeco. The Chinook, the Temperance 3, and the Opus, all was released last year. These are new knives that are just wonderful. 3.8, this is the Opus, 3.8 inch knife. The edge is 3.5 inches, total 8.8 .8 inches. S30V steel, $200 for this. It has a frame lock with stainless steel liners. It's a wonderful knife, four-way clip. Solid knife, just well-made. This is uh, the Opus for $200. Remember, all of these are a lot less than they go for on the open market. This is an original embassy with full serrated edge. It's the automatic from Spydeco. It's oh, never been used. New inbox, $200, S30V steel. Still moving along. Yeah, the Endora with the Warren Cliff blade, VG10 steel, this one or the fully serrated one, each of these $75, brand new, just received them from Spydeco not too long ago, the Warren Cliff Endora with FRN scales. This is a wonderful knife. This is the Endora. This was a MassDrop.com exclusive. The Endora 4 with Super Gold 2. 
SG2 steel. Just a wonderful, wonderful steel. Retains an edge, easy to sharpen, and they have this gold bar right here on the back lock just to let you know that it's the special special super gold 2 or sg2 steel on the endora massdrop.com 125 dollars that's la less than the massdrop.com price and remember i pay for usps um mailing you'll get it in two days remember keith kevin ken at gmail.com you have to have paypal it's goods and services only i'll send you my paypal here's the delica the delica with the super gold to this is sold out on mass drop 125 dollars for the delica version of the knife all of the knives are listed after, below, uh, with the prices. I try to get to updating that, but, <laughs> you know, I'm, I'm rushing trying to make sure that you guys' emails are getting. But as soon as I get a chance, I, up, um, I update that list. This right here is the Salt 2 Warncliffe blade. The Salt 2 is like a Delica shape. Uh, this has H1 steel and Warrencliffe blade, $80. And of course, we have the serrated version, $80 as well, with H1 steel, rust proof, yellow so you don't lose it in the water. Flippers, oh man, this is a beast of a flipper. It's the magnitude from Peter Carey. Full carbon fiber, um, custom pivot. It has the brown accents around the pivot and also a backspacer. It has a titanium clip that's custom made as well. S30V steel, $300 for $300, which believe me, is a big discount on that knife. Remember, none of these have cut anything. This right here is the Rubicon 2. I already sold the Rubicon 1 a couple of um, time, trimmings ago, but this is the one that's a lot less expensive. The S30V steel hollow ground blade, same blade, three inch, three inches long. The entire length is 7.4 inches total, 4.1 ounces. It has carbon fiber on top of G10. It's been discontinued. $185. $185 for this. And boy, it flips like a dream. I have to wipe off my sweat. Sorry, you guys. I think I told you in another one. I'm in an old apartment building that I love. But it takes them a week to switch over from heat to air conditioning and they always miss it <laughs> so right now i'm on fans and i had to turn it off to do this so i'm sweating here's the hand and that flip was my fault so let's see if we can do this again here's the hand and yeah it's the last brad southard flipper from spydeco he did the first one this is the most recent it has tie bolsters, it has tie liners, and it's one of Spydeco's flippers with the compression lock as well. This is a wonderful knife. It flips great. The uh, blade is S30V steel, $225 is what I'm asking for for this knife. Yeah, we're running out of space. We still have a lot more to go. Man, I've actually been holding this back from you guys. This is the Lion Spy. This was Spydeco working with Lion Steel to do a wonderful knife. G10 with the ridges, scales on the front. 
the tie scales on the back with the ridges, the lion steel lock right here where you can lock the frame lock in place. It has steel inserts on the frame lock to make sure that it doesn't wear down. Oh, it feels great in the hand. It's, it's a wonderful blade, 3.6 inches. It's LMAX steel. Wonderful knife. This is the Lion Spy for $285. And then Spyderco came out with the Lilla Spy. <laughs> the Little Lion Spy. Everything's the same except it's a lot smaller. You see the G10 with the ridges. You see the special lock, the small deep carry. Both of them have deep carry clips. Just really works nice. 3.1 inch blade as opposed to the 3.6 inch blade on the big one. 7.1 inch total. 3.9 ounces. And the price tag... A lot less, $140. LMAX steel again, $140. Let's see, we have more Spyderco's? Yes, we do. Ah, the Subhelt. Man, from Faladen. I love this knife. Smooth G10. The big um, stainless steel liners. The Smooth G10 backspacer. It's a beast of a knife. It has the frame lock. Um, you can see that it has the two lugs that then lock in on the back. It's part of the locking uh, process. Oh, it's a heavy duty knife that's so well made. $190 for this S30V sublock with that 3.7 inch blade. Spyderco actually did a little sub hilt as well. Here it is in my hands. Beefiness, but not as big. Man, this is a nice little mighty mic. Excuse me, of a knife. Three inches is the blade. It has the same thing, that smooth G10 with the liners, the backspace, the clip, everything except it's a lot smaller. Just a wonderful knife. S30V steel for $190. Your choice, the big one or the small one for $190 or get them both. Let's see. Alrighty. Yes, it's the Caribbean. I love this knife. I I received four Caribbeans. Uh, two plain edges and two serrated. Um, one of them in the two of them in the rescue shape, the other two in the leaf shape. This is the leaf shape. LC 200 in steel. It has this wonderful G10 rigid handle that you won't lose if you're out there fishing or whatever. Again, full serrated edge as well. This is a wonderful knife, $155 LC 200 in 3.7 inch blade with the compression lock. This is a wonderful knife, it really is. If you see me kind of stretching kind of awkwardly, it's because I, I, I'm reaching over and around uh, my camera. This right here, I don't know, I, I don't think I've ever offered this on a trimming. I've been keeping this, it's a sprint run, it's the Calypso Junior. It's super lightweight because of these scales, the FRN scales with the bi-directional. But what makes this really special, I love it because I love smaller blades. 2.4 inch blade, 6.7 inch total. But what really makes it special is it's super blue. Yeah, super blue steel. I know it's a lot of your favorites. Only $75 with the backlock. I usually don't offer it, but I'm doing it this time around. Remember, you have to say it's mine. 
I'll say it's yours once you email me at KeithKevinKen at gmail.com. You have to have PayPal. You, I'll give you my PayPal address. You have to use goods and services. I'll take care of all of that. I also take care of shipping, and I give you a great price. So um, I'm just trying to trim my collection. And I, I've been doing it, and I've been doing it by just selling to you guys here on YouTube. And I'm really happy to do that. I've been saving my little natos because I really like them. I haven't used them. All of these have not been cut, uh, uh, hasn't cut anything. This little nato S30V steel for $120 has that forward toy on a small knife and it has the compression lock. This is the plain edge, little nato for $120. Then we have the serrated edge, right? Little natives with the compression lock. And that is for 115. 120 for the plain edge, 115 for the serrated. And then we have a black edge serrated. Black blade, sorry, not black ed edge, black blade serrated again all of these with s30v steel the little native this is for 115 dollars and we have the serrated edge again s30v steel little native but with the back lock which is truly a little native right the native has a back lock but they released a lot of little natives with the compression lock which i love but this one $115 serrated with a back lock. Those are the Spydacos that are available now. Now let's talk about some Chris Reeves that are available. This is the Chris Reeves small Sabenza 21. It's called Riddled. It looks like, you see that? Like, gun shells have gone through it's really nice you can see that it goes all the way through watch the blade you can see the blade go in s35 vn steel you guys know chris reeve just wonderful knife highly discounted it's a 2.9 inch blade s35 vn steel the total length 6.9 inches 410 dollars for the small riddled knife. Here's the large one. Large Sabenza 21. The only thing missing on this is the lanyard. Other than that, just perfect. Hasn't been used. Large 3.6 inch blade. Of course, S35 VN steel, $420. If you've been looking for a Chris Reeve knife, this is the way. Oh, I've been saving this one. You haven't seen this one. I have trimmed a number of my small Nkosis, but I've been holding the original one. It's a small Nkosi, plain Jane, 2.75 inch blade. Just, just a smidge smaller than the small Sabenza 21. This is S35VN steel. This is for $360. $360. Where are we? Here is a large Sabenza 21 with a Tanto blade. 3.6 inch. S35VN steel and it has Micarta inlays. The only thing with this, it does not have the lanyard. That's it. Never been used. Even though it does have the lanyard, it's never been used. $520. $520. Of course, all of those come with the birth certificate and the oils and everything. The only thing it doesn't come with, it doesn't come with the blue rags, though, because I take those out and use them constantly. <laughs> but other than that, you'll get everything. This is, what is this? Ah, small Sabenza 21 with that combo blade. I love how Chris Reeve does his serrations.
combo blade, small Sabenza 21. This is for $325. That's 35 VN steel, of course. Let's see. And we have the big plain Jane, except, yep, it has that combo blade. S35 VN steel. Talk about a wonderful EDC knife when you have both of them. And I love that blade. S35 VN steel, uh, large Sabenza 21 with the combo blade, uh, $325. Did I say that? I'm sorry. Sorry, that was the small one. The big one is $425. $425. Trying to find a place for it. Yeah, I've been hiding the big and the small version of this. I'm not offering the small one, but I am offering the big one. I need to make room for some new knives. This is the large Sabenza 21 with that wonderful ladder Damascus blade. You see that? I love the combination. Almost a plain Jane, but then you have that wonderful ladder Damascus blade. Oh, $610. That is, believe me when I tell you, that is a huge, huge discount on that blade. We have a large Sabenza 21. This has Raindrop Damascus blade, Raindrop Damascus on the uh, front side. Just a wonderful knife, and it'll be all shined up for you. It's $610. $610. Did I do right? I'm sorry, you guys. This is $620, $620 for this one. And then we have, come on, Kevin, get with it. <laughs> then we have the Sapenza 25, $620. Remember at the end of this video, it has all the rules as well as all the knives listed and how much they are. $620, this is a Sabenza 25 with ladder Damascus, both on the scales, on the front, on the blade as well. $620. Both of these $620 a piece. And then a brand new knife that I just bought, but I have another one. This is a brand new Manundi. It has the stripe plantain um, wooden scales. S35 VN steel. This is the perfect gentleman's folder. Titanium liners, the Chris Reeve Interco frame lock. Oh man, it's just beautiful. The blade, 2.75 inches. It only weighs 1.6 ounces. $385. S35 VN steel. Look at the clip. <laughs> I sometimes carry my Manundis in my dress shirt pocket because it looks like it's an expensive pin instead of a wonderful knife. Manundi, $385. Whoops. All right, we're getting close to the end. Um... Man, my hands are sweaty. So this will, this is the Microtech QT, Microtech QT, um, L Max steel, 3.5 inch blade with the Tanto. Oh man, this is a wonderful knife. $560. Trust me, you won't find it for anything less than that. It's a wonderful knife. Automatic out the front. One of the best. Microtech knives. Listen to this. Yeah. <laughs> That's off mic. <laughs> yeah, it's the big one. It's the Halo 5 with N690 steel combo blade and <laughs> a Tanto <laughs> tip. N690, 4.6 inch blade. It comes with the Kydak sheath in the box as well. 
just a beast of a knife. This is not, you know, you press the, the blade, you cock it back, you bring it back, single action. Oh, it just is a wonderful knife. Big beast of a knife. That's the Halo 5 for $560. N690 steel. Where can we put it? Put it here. And then I have two hinderers. One, <laughs> I love this knife. It's the Maximus, the hinderer Maximus. It just flies open. Double edge knife. CPM 20 CV steel, stone wash, 3.5 inch blade, only four ounces for $400. Every single knife that you see, look at that action. Every single knife that you see, I love the carbon fiber, titanium, um, brass right there. Just, oh, it's wonderful. Um, every single knife that you see has not cut anything. It has the original, whoops, <laughs> you got to be careful. I almost reached up there to put it down and get cut myself. This is the Hinderer Maximus for $400. And then the last knife is the Hinderer Half Track. Oh, this is a beautiful knife. All ti textured titanium base. <sighs> S35 VN steel blade, 2.75 inch blade. This thing flips like a dream. The action is unbelievable. It's centered and I'm discounting it a lot at $550, $550. Here are the knives in the trimming. Remember the rules, US only. Email Keith, Kevin, Ken and say it's mine. Include the name of the knife. And if you have the number of it on the list on, and, the, and that helps too. You have to include the name of the knife in the subject. Name of the knife in the subject. Say it's mine. I'll say it's yours. You'll have 15 minutes to make your payment to PayPal. I'll give you the PayPal. It has to be goods and services. No sweat off your brow. You've got a discount already. I'll take care of all the charges and I'm shipping them out on Monday as well. Um, so priority. So with insurance. So I take care of all that. Okay. Try not to send a bunch of emails and that's it. Good luck everyone. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to support this channel. Remember, I'm only selling it to you on this channel. Wishing all of you the best. Keep those pockets full. Take good care of yourselves. Goodbye.